It's a wonderful performance in this movie. I mean, this is this is really Ronsell's story. I mean, but, but when you're reading the screenplay, because it takes quite a while till that materializes. I mean, you must have just been so enamored by this narrative. Yeah, I was I was really 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 excited to see all of the the stand-ups that he made. You know, he never. I mean, there was some things. You know, true enough. I'm gonna go out the back door, but I'm gonna say my piece. You know what I mean? And he's always that kind of guy. He's just he has a lot of love in his heart, and he's just he's bigger than life for most black people. You know, it's cool. I mean, we've I mean, just been to the writer as well, but and this is, is this sort of horrible, quite bizarre irony that he's there fighting on behalf of America right. and he's there kind of, and which unites people and he comes back to his home and it's segregating people. It's kind of ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's absolutely ridiculous, but I think it's because America is confused on its unity. You know, they, they don't know exactly what America is represented with. So I think, you know, like Carrie Mulligan was telling me the other day that um, she's from London and she was like you know as as an English person I never knew that a black soldier fought in World War II because they would never have a picture of him you know which is absolutely incredible to me you know my grandfather he he went to the Korean War and he did his thing came home and he kind of had the same struggle so it's kind of cool that I get to reincarnate him but say a lot more <laughs> <laughs> so were you able to like speak to your parents and stuff, try and get some sort of anecdotes from your from your grandfather about what he went through to try and help that inform your performance you know, actually, I, I can watch my grandfather and and just I, I can tell, you know, even if he he talks about a white person, he whispers, you know, and, and he doesn't find himself in the presence of a police at all. You know what I mean? He is definitely getting out of that jam. And I just think that um, over time, you know, I've I've developed this sort of militance watching him go through what he went through. And I'm not out here trying to start nothing, you know what I mean? But I'm definitely ready to lay law on my piece and use my gift to speak to the world and say my part. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!